Justin Haig to kick. Hilton and Leonard are deep. Hilton. The brilliant speed. Hello, goodbye. Alex Bazzi just unloaded. Well, T.Y. Hilton didn't know where he came from. Thought he saw he had his sights on the end zone. Watch Bazzi come in right there, puts his helmet right under his chin. That is the biggest hit as you will see. Oh my goodness. That is perfect form. He's, I mean, it was like a torpedo launch. Second down, 10 yards to go. Martinez the back, they fake it to him. Go out left of the flat to Evans. Evans waits one block to spring him free. He gets it. Touchdown, Marshall. Nicely developed play. Troy Evans with a run after catch and a beautiful drive for the thundering herd to start things off. How about a couple of blocks out in front of Evans and a good cutback. Block, block, but well, there you go. And then boom. See, you got two receivers downfield blocking. by Omar Brown. Brown still on his feet. Not six. Brown has an alley, and Brown has the end zone. A 48-yard interception for a touchdown. Omar Brown, who has been one of the leading tacklers for Marshall the last couple of years, a senior on that defense, and comes up for the play of the day. You just don't have this margin for error if you're UAB. And uh, you know what? Not a perfect pass, but give the kid in the green jersey a lot of credit there. Omar Brown elevates, squeezes it. Don't get it blocked. Oh, excuse me. They are going to try to run for it. Instead, now throw. And it's caught at the 10, and it's Dobson for a touchdown. Holy cow. That for a play call. Tron Martinez, the fake is to him, and that pass is up for grabs and caught. Looks like they're going to give it to the offense. It's a tie, and Booker will make the grab. Boy, some guys today, as a gain of 28 yards, are making plays that they frankly haven't made all year. No doubt about it. You can see here a good throw. And it's really a simultaneous catch, which, you know, goes to the receiver in that situation. That one's tipped and intercepted. Omar Brown got it on the deflection. And Marshall with a minute 21. He's in the driver's seat here. Louisville does still have their three timeouts left. They could get the ball back, but it's not likely that they could come back and win this one at this point unless something dramatic happens for Marshall. Like you say, they do have all three. Quarterback keeper, design play, fumble on the ground, inside the 40, still loose. Scooped up at the 10 5 touchdown, Marshall. Oh, my. In those kickoffs, he's never punted in a college game before. They come after him, and he gets off a really good boot that drives Booker all the way back to the 13. And Booker has a lane. Andre Booker down the sideline looking to pick up a block. He does. Look at this! Marshall strikes first! Marshall 87-yard punt return for Andre Booker. You're supposed to make the first guy miss. Watch what he does. He makes four guys miss. Right there you see, now he gets a great block on the outside there. That gets cleaned up. He's out to the corner. Now it's all she wrote. He's got his guys coming back to help. 
since he cleared four guys, he had a lot of guys to help him. Third and eight, FIU shows blitz. Cato throws off his back foot. A flag is down. The catch is made anyway. Jermaine Kelson somehow able to pull that one in. Gain of 25 at the 25. FIU very aggressive with their coverage. Press outside. You can see the defender Ooh. hanging all over. We're supposed to block who? And we talked to Marshall. That was the one thing that they wanted to do was to be able to create confusion. But there was obviously some confusion that time between the left tackle and left guard of Marshall. As Daryl Johnson was unblocked, that's back-to-back -back pass plays where they don't have a defender blocked. Three-man rush, he's going for Dobson. Dobson, the big, strong receiver! <laughs> yes! Wow! 6'3", 204 pounds, muscles! A touchdown in! We talked about how big and fast and talented number three Aaron Dotson is. This is just a corner fade route with the one-handed, unbelievable catch, James. Maybe the best catch I've seen all year, and we've seen some incredible.